Big Band John. Big John. Nobody seemed to know where John called home. He just drifted into town and stayed all alone. Didn't say much. He's kind of quiet and shy. And if you spoke at all, you just said hi to Big John. Somebody said he came from New Orleans where he got in a fight over a Cajun queen and a crashing blow from a huge right hand sent a Louisiana fella to the promised land, Big John. Big John, Big John, a bigger bad John. Big John. Then came the day at the bottom of the mine when a timber cracked and men started crying. Miners were praying and hearts beat fast and everybody thought that they'd breathe their last, said John. Through the dust and the smoke of this man-made hell walked a giant of a band that the miners knew well. Grabbed a sagging timber and came out with a groan and like a giant oak tree just stood there alone, Big John. Big John. Big Bad John. Big John. With all his strength, he gave a mighty shove, and a miner yelled out, there's a light up above, and 20 men scrambled for would-be graves. Now there's only one left down there to save Big John. With Jack's September, they started back down, and came that rumble way down in the ground, and the smoke and gas belched out of that mine. Everybody knew it was the end of the line for Big John. Big Band John. Big John. Now they never reopened that worthless pit. They just placed a marble stand in front of it. These few words are written on that stand. At the bottom of this mine lies a big, big man. Big John. Big John. Big John. A Big Band John. John. A big bad John. <laughs>